back, welcome back. Hope you're doing well. And into the grotto we go. I think this is where they're said to go? Yeah. Look at all the wo Look at all the wonderful things Flounder and I have collected. I think it's all from the outside world. Someday, I'm gonna see what's out there. I wanna see other worlds. Does that sound strange? No, not for a teenager, I guess. I'm just joking. I used to feel the same way. Used to? I mean, I still do. I'm not a, a dimensional world traveler who goes in some sort of psychedelic space. Hey, why don't we try look for that uh, keyhole they were talking about? Wink, wink, wink. But your father said, um... Oh, he treats me... Uh, oh, he treats me like a little girl. He never wants to let me do anything. He just... He just doesn't understand. I have to go ease... Or what it, Jamaican voice. I have to go eavesdrop on her. Your Majesty, I heard them talking about a keyhole. I think he's going to bang your daughter. <laughs> Where is it? What is this really big fish you can swim against the currents? But he's scared of those weird things swimming around. So if I chase him away, I think the big fish will play with us. We play with us. Maybe if you grab onto him, he'll take you somewhere. Alright, fine. I don't remember you having a Scottish accent, but I mean, that'll do. Another thing about uh, the creatures, they have humanoid faces on them. So one time Sora's like, eh, what's uh, what's your deal, hey buddy? What's, what's with the human face? I'm actually a witch's familiar. Oh sweet, two torn pages. Means we can go to Winnie's world after. Actually, I want to go there pretty dang soon. Uh... That one, although it looks like the other ones can't be opened. Can't be opened there. Oh, I'm looking at this wall here. I'm not doing so good, guys. I'm sorry, Flounder. We'll take you down to Africa. Um, what? Is this... I think we just leave now, probably. Or... She's got three Mickey Mouse ears. Doesn't really look like a bow tie. So we can leave now? Good call. Oh, that's it? What the fuck? I, li I got my golden pimp eye in. The pimp will never find the keyhole. But the girl could prove useful, and I've got a heartless <laughs> on my spider webs in there. Triton, my old friend, <laughs> your day is coming. Bah, 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 bah. Hey, I want to go good pizza, order pizza that sounds so good under the sea. I wonder if they deliver under this river. <laughs> I doubt that could be. Ariel just spins and like, it's like swim frolicking. She just yelled, please. Are they just recycling her sound files from the movie? So now we go back here. It's interesting how the sun shines down on the kingdom there, but uh, it's really over looking like the Mariana's Trench or whatever. Stop running! You know what? I'll take more aggressive opponents on then. Mother 
these guys suck. Underwater, <laughs> they teleport on their cheap little bastards. Okay, it doesn't settle on the bottom, it just sinks down a little bit. It mimics sinking in water, it doesn't actually properly sink. Whatever. I apparently am the only one who isn't taking a beating in this. <laughs> Although, yes, these guys hit pretty damn hard. Seem to hit for like 10 ish health. Here we go. I mean, this is decent as far as water levels go, but still. Just, I don't know. Water levels, it's kind of a mixed bag because they're always a sort of a limitation. And I can see why people don't like them, and I almost go as far to say all water levels are terrible, except, like, I was one of those few people in World of Warcraft, the whole underwater zone. I love that because it was just beautiful, and I thought it was pretty well designed. They gave you the seahorse. As long as they accommodate for it, it's pretty awesome, but. It generally just makes things a slower pace. So unless you want to be there, it kind of hampers the experience. Now we're not... You came all this way swimming like that? <laughs> you fucking idiots. But what, what's wrong with how I swim? Whoever you are, I want you to thank you for helping Ariel. <laughs> Sir, are you one of the aliens from Mars Attacks? So the eels came, and then what? Well, maybe this one has candy. Oh, save spot. Hmm. Save? Okay. Ah, I floated it. Let's try to float the other way. Um. I guess I should travel to another spot. Can I fast travel from here? No, I cannot. Um, do we leave and it triggers a cutscene? Do we go back to the grotto? I guess we need to cover more ground. Cleared here. This didn't trigger any events. We go back into the grotto. The fucking sea serpents were there. Nothing of note on top. Interesting seeing the seaweed wiggle. Yeah, wait, Flounder, you were here all along and you didn't stop winky and blinky? Oh, you see? Uh, I didn't quite register. There's this really big fish who can swim against the current. It's a dolphin, which isn't a fish. But, uh, I'm Flounder. Yeah, take care, Flounder. We love you. Oh, let's take the big fish. Come on, big fish. Stop. Stop your running. Get off of you goddamn freeloaders, you fucking weirdos. I know how you get your kicks, you disgust me. Why are we going in one spot? What is there to gain from this? What, what, what could we have possibly gained from that? So we have to find a dwarfin to take us against the grain, huh? Well, let's go find a dwarfin. Please don't have reset the spawns. We... So we could go here. Nope. Ah, uh, it's gone. Take time to fight them. Oh, what's this then? 
I got a potion. Um, this looks like it's important for a story event later. Can we go up? No. Yeah, it feels safe when you're in this reef, but popping out. Look, open water is scary as shit. It's like it's like space. It's infinite. So I guess we have to backtrack from the area we came from. Donald, you goofy bastard. Yeah, they're in the way. The dolphin won't take us though to the next part of the cave or nothing. Big ball of money. Oh, it's only 20. It's actually pretty disappointing. I was hoping it'd be at least 50. I have not been paying attention to actually how much money it drops from there. I guess we have to backtrack through here. No, I don't know how to get you guys. I'll save you for later. Ooh. There's a dolphin. Pretty sure we can go down that there. I don't know if we take the dolphin to swim underneath it or uh, just do it regularly. Oh, she already healed him. Loaded. Your ass got exploded. Guess we wait for the 302 dolphin bus. Hello, Mr. Dolphin. Are you coming? We want to give you a, the treats. Vroom, 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 vroom. Um. Guess we have to pursue the dolphin. Someone, please. I think she just says that anytime she gets hit. Well, Donald went out like a chump. Although I do like how in this game how you can heal this regular heal to revive people. You don't need revives. Phoenix Towns or the like. Spectral. It's hard to tell what he says. Thunder Jim. Ooh, we already got this one. Um does this do a thing? Wait, no. The thermal vent, sort of. Grab onto the dolphin, and you are our pet right now. Ow. Thank you for the fast travel. You will get us there quicker. -er. Wait, you're going the wrong way. Ooh, finally. Is that where we go any further up? Do we want to go there? Whoa, you asshole fuck dolphin! You shithead! That's what you get, you pricks! He knocked us back into here. Well, I guess we're enemies now, dolphin. experience them. <laughs> That's decent. You 
could be healing me, you could be killing them. <laughs> I'm always gonna heal myself for Donald. Sorry, that's just a smart thing to do, Donald. I wonder if Donald's uh, ice ability is second level. Anyways, that's the end of this episode. Thank you very much for stopping by. Take care of yourself. Hope you have a tremendous day, and peace out. Thank you.